this video, I'll be taking a closer look at Gandalf on cart and Escape Off the Road by Weta Workshop. Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, um, I invite you to look at some of my other videos. Check them out if you like the content. Um, I would ask that you subscribe, hit the bell button. And for this video, I wanted to take a closer look at two Master Collection series from Weta. This one is Gandalf on Cart. This is the second one that they released after Gollum. It's significantly bigger, um, the base, but I think that they capture the scene very well. Like I said with Gollum, I think that the paint job is good. I think the sculpt is good. I think the execution, the delivery, everything about this piece just screams master collection. Some pieces are very fragile. You know, when you get down the stem holding like the mushrooms and stuff like that, if you're gonna move these things around, you know, it's prone to certain little breakages. I believe from discussing other collectors, um, when you're inserting this wood through this strap, that had a tendency to break. So another reason why I'm doing it in place and not putting this up on a pedestal is it's in perfect condition and I just want to keep it that way. I missed out on Treebeard. That's like one of my biggest regrets. I love that piece, but unfortunately at the current price, I'll probably never own it. I passed up on Thranduril because it's just too big for me. It's not that I didn't like the piece and overall I'm okay with the Hobbit, but this one, Escape Off the Road, this was one of the pieces when it went up, it was another instant push. There's certain scenes in the movie and this is one of them for me, you know, Frodo's on the road, he sees the wind come and he screams, get off the road. I mean, you can just feel it. It's, it's one of those moments in the fellowship where it just grabs you. I recently watched it with my daughter, Maya, and I noticed when Frodo was going to put the ring on his finger, he pulled his face back. And now that I'm looking at that sculpt, I think that Brigitte did a great job at capturing it. There's so much detail in this piece. If I hadn't said it yet, these are significantly bigger than normal pieces and they have a price tag to go along with them. But having them, I personally feel that they're absolutely worth it. So if you have them, I'm sure you feel the same way. If you don't and you have an opportunity to get one, you know, and you have the affordability to get one, I recommend that you do. They're really two really great pieces. If you have any questions, you want to see any closer pictures of them, you know, hit me up in the comments. Um, if not, I appreciate you watching and I hope to see you on the next one.